lives and works today. Throughout the ages, men have experienced this reality. Yes, when they turned to Him in prayer, God did hear and intervene. Their troubles were really changed. But perhaps you're asking yourself, how should I pray so that I can experience His power in my life? The answer is in today's meditation by Basilea Schlink called Childlike Prayer. God has given a special promise to childlike trusting prayer. Again and again, Jesus urges us to become like children, for to them the kingdom of heaven belongs. Yes, to them, God's fatherly heart is open. Children win the Father's heart by their childlike trust as they come to Him with their smallest needs, asking for even the littlest things. Jesus says, if an earthly father can't give a stone to his child when he asks for bread, how much more will the Father in heaven do good to us, his children, when we come to him like children? In order to have God hear our prayers, we have to have a childlike relationship of love and trust to him as our heavenly Father. If such a prayer is according to his will, it will not be disappointed. It may be, of course, that he will hold back the answer to a prayer. If there is a specific obstacle hindering the prayer, such as uncleansed and unrepentant sin, but it can also be that he is withholding a gift from us in order to teach us something, so that later he can give to us even more abundantly. Hasn't James put his finger on our main problem when he writes in James 4, verse 2, You do not have because you do not ask. We are lacking childlike prayer. Yes, we remain poor with many needs simply because we are too unchildlike to ask. We take precautions so that we don't even come into a situation where we might have to ask the Father for help. God, however, wants to be a Father to us. He wants us to come to Him with every one of our needs. He waits for children who will ask of Him time and time again, because as a loving Father, it is His joy to do us good and to give us gifts. Heavenly Father, I'm Thy child. Is there better to be found as such loving union? Oh, how blessed to be with Thee secure to be by thy love surrounded. Heavenly Father, I'm thy child. Tell me, is there anything in the world more blessed? How can trouble hurt or harm while I rest within God's arm? God esteems me precious. This program by Basilea Schlink has come to you from the little land of Canaan. If you would like a free leaflet by the same author, please write to God Lives and Works Today, 9849 North 40th Street, Phoenix, Arizona, 85028-4099. That's God Lives and Works Today, 9849 North 40th Street, Phoenix, Arizona, 85028-4099. God bless you.